Thanks for joining us. I'm Terry McSweeney. Audrey has the night off. Big crowds turning out today for San Francisco's Earth Day Festival. Streets were shut down. Spirits were high in the Mission District. And welcome back to the festival for the first time since the pandemic. NBC Bay Area's Alyssa Gord shows us what's on the menu. Well, the Earth Day Festival is finally back here in the Mission. And this year, all the food vendors you see up and down the street are vegan. <laughs> San Francisco's volunteer-led Earth Day Festival has returned. This tradition is more than a decade old. It's really important, especially here in San Francisco, because as we know, all the politicians here all speak the rhetoric. They're all speaking the rhetoric of climate change, but what are we actually doing about it? So for 2022, the festival is focusing on how what we eat can impact the planet. Organizers are hoping to show off the benefits of going plant-based, even if it's just for one meal. Gabriel Ventura is making vegan pupusas to offer a taste of El Salvador, where he's from. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's a beautiful day, and you know it's a really good, great opportunity for us. The youngest people at the festival are excited about the food, but they also say they're anxious about the planet. When I think about climate change, I feel like. Um, this is something that needs a lot of work. So today they're celebrating the earth. Doing stuff little by little, it helps. All the little things build up into something big. And urging grown-ups to protect it for years to come. For Earth Day, um, I want you guys to not pollute the ocean and really take care of your earth because Mother Earth is the only planet we got right now. In San Francisco, Alyssa Gord, NBC, Bay Area News.